Hey, this is Matt Drury coming at you from DOD TV. Brandon Jennings is hitting the Missouri hunting ground in search of a shooter. And it isn't long before a massive stud named Grim finds his way into our hunter's sights. However, expecting the unexpected is something every hunter should be prepared for. Let's find out if Brandon Jennings can recover from an unintended camera conundrum. This episode of DOD TV is brought to you by the Bullseye Camera System by SME. See your point of impact on your target from up to a mile away with this easy to use wireless target camera. All right, here we are in here with my son Parker tonight. Every plan we had tonight when we came down here was to go to a blind about 600 yards that way. But before we went over there, we came in here to pull carts on this blind. And we've had mature bucks on this food plot a lot here in the last three days. And one of the bucks we're looking for named Grim actually came through here and went to bed at 610 this morning. You gotta figure he's bedded within a couple hundred yards of us in here somewhere. You know, there have been several deer moving early tonight and we're watching several smaller bucks. We got a few does out in front of us and I catch movement over to our left and break them loophole binoculars out and couldn't believe who it was. Here comes Grim. You know, what you're not gonna see on this footage, Grim comes out and hangs out down there with that other buck for 45 minutes, just sitting there, he's trying our patience. But when he finally starts to come in, this is when the blind comes into play. That battery light had been red for a long time and he didn't tell me. And when he's at 32 yards, the battery dies. So we still have a secondary camera rolling, but this buck is in range and I'm having to dig clear to the bottom of the camera bag to see if I can get the backup battery out. You can really get away with a lot in a blind. We've got a lot of camera equipment. We've got more than one hunter moving around, trying to make this whole thing come together. But we finally get the battery in, clicked on record just in time. You know, even though I hit that buck perfect, we didn't find a whole lot of blood at first and the blood trail kind of confused us. It got dark on us. We needed the flashlights by the time we got to him and I, I lost it. And I really wanted to do this buck justice. You know, this is a magnum eight pointer. So we decided to bring him out in the daylight and do the interviews. All right, here we are in here with my Missouri buck I shot last night. I wanted to bring him out in the daylight so we could get a better look at him. It's a great hunt. My son Parker, it's the first time he ever filmed me shooting a buck and I watched the footage last night and he did a smash job. I couldn't be more proud of you. Thanks for coming out. Now, now it's your turn. You and your mom are up to bat, that's for sure, but I can't wait to start getting after them with you guys. We're adding new videos every week, so make sure to click that subscribe button and check out all of our amazing content. This episode of DOD TV was brought to you by MOTV. For full episodes of Bow Madness and all of our outdoor channel content, head over to the MOTV app and view it today.